Welcome to Sunspots here on Shaw TV. My name is Ryan Waters. The Okanagan Sun picking up their seventh victory of the year, a convincing 50 to six win over the Camelot Broncos this past weekend. Week eight of the BCFC. This offense is rolling. They scored over 160 points in the last three games, so we thought it appropriate to invite two members of the Okanagan Sun offensive side this week. Quarterbacks coach Nat Nagy and starting quarterback Jeremy Morovic. And coach, first we'll start with you. You're the first year uh, quarterback coach for the Sun. You have a first year starting quarterback. Are you guys learning together in the BCFC? Oh, definitely. Um, I think early on it was just a feeling out process for me and JJ just to get to know each other so that we could communicate well enough and he could see what I'm trying to get him to do on the field, on the practice field with his teammates. And as that relationship's built, I think the offense has progressed much more smoothly to the point now where I'm more or less refining what he's doing as opposed to trying to change anything and things are moving forward pretty well. It's got to be comfort level then. Is that why the offense is putting up so many so much big numbers in the last uh, few games? I would think so. I think it's just a matter of time. JJ's first year here and so a lot of the receivers that he's working with and the offensive line and stuff, it takes a while to get the feel of working with all new personnel for him and as things have gotten refined in practice and everything else it's starting to translate over onto the field during the game day. You feel a lot more comfortable now with your teammates? Coach was talking about the comfort level. Do you feel more comfortable in the huddle and then calling plays? I do. Um, we all know each other now. Um, we've been playing together for you know, two, two and a half months now. So, you know, when I'm in the huddle, whether it be practice or in a game, we all know each other fairly well and we're not afraid to voice our opinions when we see things and our communication is just, you know, it's, it's second to none right now. Coach, I throw it back to you as the Chilliwack Huskers, your next opponent. You go to Chilliwack this weekend. How are you preparing for a team like the Huskers, who are struggling this year? They haven't picked up a victory. How is the offense in a whole uh, preparing for the Huskers? I think at this point in the season, no matter who we're playing, we're more focused on what we're going to do than what the other team's doing as we get ready to finish up the season and get in the playoffs. We feel like if we can keep progressing forward as a unit ourselves and refining what we're trying to do, then come game day, whoever our opponent is, things will fall into place as they have. Are you always refining, always progressing, always preparing for the Vancouver Island Raiders, a big matchup coming up on October 9th? Regardless of who we're playing, we feel that if we get to the point where we dial things down and do what we know we're capable of doing, no matter who shows up here, we're comfortable with what we're doing. Jeremy, your first year as a member of the Sun, do you get a sense of the rivalry between the Raiders and the Sun? I know the Raiders are still a couple weeks away. You still have to prepare for the Huskers. But do you get a sense of, of how the rivalry has shaped up the last few years between the Sun and the Raiders? You know, I've only been told stories, but after going down to Caledonian Park and playing them there, you really realize what it's all about in this, in this conference when you play them in their place. And then, you know, now when they come here, it's, it's not like playing any other team in the league. I don't know what it is really but it's I don't know it's it's game day and when, and when Vancouver Island Raiders come to town you better be on your A game. Well before the Sun can face the Raiders they'll go to Chilliwack to face the Huskers this coming weekend. For more information log on to OkanaganSun.ca. For Sunspots here on Shaw TV I'm Ryan Waters.